We all knew that was going to happen. Again, I said something negative about Kabam. I put something negative out. I have even been saying negative things about the war, so punishment well deserved. <laughs>Welcome back to the channel. All right, the banquet rewards are in much earlier than uh, expected, but this is really cool. My line chat started uh, blowing up and I do already know my alliance scores. I don't know my individual. I did have some fun. I will get out eventually the Christmas opening and back from vacation. Work is gonna get started here. So I'm gonna get back to making the videos and those sorts of things. Uh, and my Christmas opening was phenomenal. Uh, phenomenal, phenomenal, phenomenal. But uh, this is timely. This is now. So let's see. I, I have no idea what to expect. I didn't make a massive push. I'm not expecting anything crazy, but still, and we should have something to open up today. So let's see. Uh, I don't know if Alliance is first or 465th. I did not expect that. I did not expect that. I do not recall where the um, different markers and things like that were, as I kind of said, like I, I'm not, I don't advise getting caught up in that chase because you end up uh, going way more than you think because it's a blind auction, it's how blind auctions work. Uh, so I very purposely didn't pay attention to any of that. I knew I wasn't going for like the top 30 or whatever. Uh, so this is, I'm actually a little shocked. I'm gonna process this a little bit. Um, okay, so we got a lot of good stuff to open here. This is pretty cool. Um, considering I was completely surprised by all of this um i think we're just gonna go with weapon x to uh get seven star shards i'm not i'm not really that fussed about any of the rest of that and um this is an interesting one this is an interesting one because as you can see uh, my allotment of tier six class catalyst is pretty good right now i've been kind of waiting on a bunch of stuff i have reasons for doing this um I, uh, I'm going to take at least one mutant. Uh, Try not to spoil my openings, but it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. The opening's great on its own. So we'll do that. Uh, we'll take a mystic. And then uh, I think I'll go for some balance here. I think I'll go for some balance because it looked like my uh, tech was pretty low. I don't really have any tech champions I'd be overly excited about bringing up. Uh, yeah, no, I don't really have any. <laughs> Come on, let's get some better seven star text. Um, yeah, I'm trying to think if there's any, there's none in the, so I think I'm going to go here because, um, science is so incredibly strong and I'm aware of science champions I want to rank. Uh, yeah, there we go. It was a little hard to do without, uh, totally spoiling my Christmas opening. It was that good. Uh, and there's some instant rank champions uh you know we'll go we'll go all this uh because yeah for reasons <laughs> uh and then my line savage squad uh this is really interesting i saw we we everyone was pretty excited because we scored 24th which is really shocking to me uh based on how what i thought was a very low score um but again i think this is these are events that work like this right we oft, i often compare the game to like a fancy club and uh, and so, you know, the massive whales kind of carry the day. They kind of carry the day there. So mm, that's fine. Uh, you know, what? we're going to go mystic because there are mystic champions. I love I love the mystic class. I love the mystic class. I do think it's pretty strong. And there are champions in the Titan pool that I would probably instant rank to uh, like werewolf and that sort of thing. So let's get to opening. Let's get to opening. Let's have a good time with this. I think we're going to do relics first. Okay, I realized it was close enough to the seven star that if I opened up some six stars, I'd be able to open up two seven stars. Didn't want to have you watch all that, though. Uh, so let's get to the exciting stuff. We're going to open up this six star relic. There's a bunch of mainly uh, mystic six star relics I would love to awaken. So let's awaken one of those, right? The relic game is getting really, really strong. You know, I enjoy relics, so I'm pumped up on this. Um, yeah, I'm excited about this. I really enjoy relics, so we're getting to use them a lot in Necropolis. They're great in Battlegrounds and War. We can use them there. I think they just add a lot to the game. So I'm a big fan and would love to get Scarlet Witch, Juggernaut, or that Ghost Rider as they go around. This would be amazing. Yes! That's huge. I'm so excited. She is phenomenal for Kushala. She's phenomenal for Kushala. You see, I haven't told you. I got to be helped, be part of the design process for Kushala. 
<laughs> it's actually true. Those of you who are like, really? Uh, why is he laughing? <laughs> I, I'm laughing because I, I love saying it. It's really, really cool. You can go to the Champion Spotlight page. You'll see. There's a link to me right there. Uh, so I'm really pumped up on that, and we're going to put that on our Kusha. Uh, I'll just do it because this video will take long enough as it is. But trust me, it will be there really pumped up. This is a good day. This is a good day. This is a good day. Uh, well, except for all that Alliance War stuff going on. I did a community post on that. Uh, we can talk about it on stream. It's it's infuriating to me. Okay, let's move on. Let's get back to the positives. Actually, they probably heard that, and I am now going to pull a bunch of uh, red goblins. So, here we go. Uh, you know, there's champions we want to awaken. There's champions we want to get. I would love to get... I believe Spot is now in the basic. Uh, Juggernaut. Let's have some fun. Oh, I hate that. That's always a bad sign. Although that may have reversed the bad luck that I'm sure Kabam put on my account after I said something negative. How dare you say anything negative? Oh, uh, well, you know what? I think it's a bunch of BS, uh, the way they're handling war. I think it's a bunch of absolute BS. All right, come on. Let's get Spot. I see that Spot running around. I love playing Spot. I need to get him at least once before I can awaken him, and I would want him awakened. A lot of really great silver linings in here. Gambit is not one of them. That is really bad. That is really, really bad, considering I already have him, already have him awakened. I do have him ranked two, does some really cool stuff. I think he's a cool champion, uh, but that is not what I'm wanting to see. That is not what I'm wanting to see. All right, let's make up for it. Let's balance out, let's balance out this bad luck. I guess I got the Scarlet Witch, so it already is balanced. Maybe that was the balance. All right, let's get back. To the good side of this. Ooh, Atuma would be cool. I would be really excited about waking my Atuma. Would potentially take him up to rank two. Even just at Sig 20. So that would be awesome. I'd love that. Thanks for giving me that show. Come on. We're going to as quickly as possible move on from there. Um, okay, I mean, that was two basically pointless uh, seven stars, except for uh, getting that. That's cool. Getting that many Titan shards, those are the big deal, as we all know. And uh, yeah, I mean, that's how the Titan pool is. You know, that's when it would increase. I was like, I actually don't like it, but uh, it is what it is. And now we will open up. This is, I think, the biggest one here. This is the biggest one, is the four to five. Uh, I don't even want, you know what? My luck couldn't get worse. So uh, after those two pulls, so I will just say there's one class I just desperately do not want. It is mutant. But I think we all know that's what I'm gonna get right now. Uh, I think every other class I have a champion or two champions that would immediately come to mind, immediately come to mind. And we got the Ascension Dust from Necropolis and things like that coming in. So we'd be able to ascend a champion uh, relatively soon. So just not mutant. It's not that hard, Kabam. You could do it. You could do it. You could do the not mutant for me. Of course, it's going to be mutant. There it is. We all knew that was going to happen. Again, I said something negative about Kabam. I put something negative out. I have even been saying negative things about the war. So punishment well deserved. <laughs> I'm totally kidding. There's uh, I, there's no way I think that they actually would do that sort of thing. Uh, they don't even have the power. Just for those of you who don't, you know, I know sarcasm doesn't always come through. Uh, this is really disappointing. We can take a quick look at my six-star mutant roster. And, uh, okay, so here it is. Here's the mutant six-star roster. You know, I would be semi-tempted to take up Wolverine X. He is awesome. Tom Jarvis did a great, great, great showcase on him. He's obviously a very good Battlegrounds defender too. You know, actually I look at it, I kind of forgot about Iceman. I've been slowly ranking him up, took him to rank four for the current Battlegrounds meta. So I actually may take him up. Um, and there's just no one else. You know, we know the champion's coming out next month and um, they don't seem to be uh, mutants. There's Apocalypse sitting right there. So I could consider that, but I actually think it's going to be... Uh, I think I'm going to be taking up Iceman now that I think about it. In fact, in fact, let's do that right now. Let's do an instant rank up live right here for you all. 
going to rank five, making use of that gem. I don't see any other uses coming along soon, so I'm pumped up to do this. I'll rank them up off off camera. Thank you so much for watching. I hope uh, I hope banquet went even better for you than it did for me. It's a fun event as long as you. Um, in my opinion, you just don't try to like make a certain, you just open what you can, have some fun with it, and then put it away. And then you end up where you end up. That's always my advice. I'll give that same advice next year. You've given it the last three years. Uh, but I hope yours went really, really well. If you, if you got more than you thought you were going to get, let me know in the in the comments. I always enjoy that. Uh, kind of like me. I did way better than I thought I would do. And I think a lot of that's because I wasn't trying to do good. I just had some fun, opened up some stuff, and then when I was done, I was done. Thank you so much for watching. We'll continue to start getting out the videos. I'm back. Uh, I'm home. My vacation's over. So we'll, we'll get back to making those videos. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.